Hey everybody and welcome to TK Power Sports. So today we have the chance to drive the newest member of the Talon family here with Honda, the 1000R. And if you think the R stands for race, well, you're absolutely right. This thing is insane. And we're here in Jay, Oklahoma, running at Mid-America. And you've got to see what this machine will do. Let's start off with a quick walk around on this Talon 1000R. Now, you've seen the Talon. The Talon was actually born in 2019 as a two-seater. Then, you know, as time went on, it got stretched to four seats. They added various items to it. And now we have the R. The R primarily has to do with more suspension, wider track, and upgraded things such as the power steering and various other features that reduce fatigue when you're beating on this thing all day long. One of the coolest things about the Talon is that this thing is made to go off-road fast. All right, you know, the amount of suspension travel here, I can't measure it, but you can see it. I mean, this is insane in terms of the amount of travel just on that front A-arm. That and the fact that the design of the vehicle puts that engine just forward of the rear axle, so your main weight is sitting right about back in here. I mean, it just, it's a tremendous amount of downforce for where the torque is going to get to the ground. Now, the idea with the four seats, well, you know, Honda is a very family oriented company. They want to make sure that you can take your whole family out. Now, there's also another aspect to that. These machines are getting more and more expensive. So if you're going to spend, you know, twenty to thirty thousand dollars on something like this, well, at least then you can justify it in your mind saying, well, I'm also taking my wife and I'm taking the kids. Or at the very least, you can cram some of your buddies in there and make them pay for gas. So having said all that, this machine is not practical for anything other than super rough trails, running fast in the desert, fording incredibly deep water, going up ridiculously steep slopes. And if any of that appeals to you, then that's what you want to do with a talent. You're not going to hook this up to your little dump trailer and go rake leaves. That's not what this is all about. But then again, that's okay. Because frankly, Honda really turned a corner about five years ago. They went from very, very utility-based. Uh, they obviously looked at the success of people like Can-Am and Polaris and even Yamaha and said, well, hey, we got to get in on that. And frankly, this this unit here is second to none, and their race team bears that out. They've been winning, most recently, the Baja 500, and frankly, we've got some fantastic video of the race team and some of those interviews right here. My name is Madison Eberts. I am the four-wheel PR coordinator at American Honda. So we're super excited to be here at Mid-America Outdoors in Jay, Oklahoma uh, for the all-new model Talon 1000 R4. Uh, this model completes the Talon family. We introduced the model first in 2019 uh, with the two-seat versions of the Talon X and R. Um, and then following years, increase added Fox Live valve uh, as well as a four-seat X model. This year, we've announced the four-seat R model. Highly anticipated, we're super excited about it. Completely the Talon family and at Honda we're all about family uh, those four seats take your family out on the trails um, in a performance car. 
One of the things we're doing here in Oklahoma is we're running up and down stream beds. Yeah, full of water. And we had massive thund thunderstorms last night, so we've got whole flooded sections. And you know, this is all river rock. We're not on any dirt. This is just stone, stone, stone. And it's amazing to think that these tires are able to take this kind of punishment. And quite frankly, yeah, you know what? We did have a flat last night, but you know, on a dozen units running at full tilt down these rock strewn stream beds, that in itself is pretty amazing. That and the fact that the clearance on these machines is so important impressive that we keep hitting massive washouts and divots and we just don't bottom. So we've been running these creek beds, but of course that's at the bottom of the valley. So we're also climbing the valley walls. And I can tell you on my inclinometer, I have seen 38 degrees going uphill and you'd swear that it was gonna stall, but it is phenomenal amount of grip that you're getting in this vehicle and you know partly that has to be the engine design with that engine you know midships just sort of forward of the rear axle it's putting all that weight right where the torque needs to be and it just claws its way out of anything so you know being behind the wheel when you think it's going to stall halfway up the hill and it just never does Power-wise, of course, we're sitting on a thousand cc's, and that in itself is plenty. However, a Honda gives you a number of really smart ways to manage that power. Uh, for instance, you do have a sport button, and what this does is uh, lengthen the shifts so that you stay higher up in the torque band if that's what you want. You've, of course, also got a high and a low range, and in addition to that, the suspension itself is adjustable. Uh, you got a comfort setting, you've also got a sports setting, and the sports setting not only uh, gives you a stiffer ride, but it actually increases the height of the suspension because it is that much stiffer. The reality is, is that at one time Honda didn't play the horsepower game, but I guess those days are over because this uh, this beast is as powerful, quick, and rugged as any of its competition. One of the new features on the Talon is an increase in the power of their electric power steering. I believe it's up to 40% stronger than before, including more damping. And when you're out running trails like we're doing here today in Oklahoma with severe angles and just sawing back and forth, you know, you really feel what you're feeling is not only that your feedback is less, but over time, you don't get that sense of fatigue where the older model would beat you up. One of the other features on the Talon here today is a launch mode. I always laugh because I don't know that it's really good for anything. However, it is super fun to engage launch mode. Gives you the ability to get the revs right up to red line and then just drop the hammer and it takes off like a scared rabbit. It's, uh, it's fun, but just make sure you do it in a big wide open field. So the Talon, the R, and this is the family vehicle. We've got four doors. However, don't think that the back seats are made just for kids. Uh, we've had full-sized adults, guys from the Honda racing team that have been sitting in the back riding along with us. And you know what? They're, uh, you know, certainly comfortable and have got plenty of room to handle the rocking and rolling that's going on during this really, really, really rough trail ride. So, you know, four-seater is not just uh, a marketing gimmick. This thing really is a four-seater. For adults, yeah, you can get them out on the trail in this thing.
one of the big deals these days are the accessories that come with these units. Now, what Honda has done is already given you punch outs and blanks where you can put in additional light switches. And for instance, last night when we were riding, we had an overhead light bar, auxiliary lights on the front of the unit, certainly lit up the night. Uh, another great item is this Garmin. It's specifically set up for trail. I mean, it's a GPS, but it actually shows you and all your buddies and where you are on the trail and keeps track of where you've gone to, in addition to which it will give you lots of information such as pitch and roll with an inclinometer, altimeter, so lots of stuff that you want to know as you're going along. And of course, you can get windshields, roofs, various other things that the aftermarket has been doing for years. But now, Honda will give you the accessories right from their own catalog. For 2023, the Talon 1000R4 gets a new Fox live valve shock. And in addition to which, there's a few changes in particularly stance. It's slightly wider. And... It's got some upgrades specifically to the power steering system. And at this point, I just have to interrupt myself to let those Canadians who are watching this know that sadly we do not get this model in Canada at this time. Honda Canada, in its wisdom, has decided that for some reason we don't need this. Also the reason that I traveled to Oklahoma to drive it and now, having come home, I'd say, gee, I really wish we'd have it. However, that's the end of my complaint. The Honda Talon is powered by a 999cc liquid-cooled parallel twin four-stroke. It's fuel-injected, six-speed automatic dual-clutch transmission with a high-low setup. We've got two drive modes, two-wheel drive, and more importantly, the intelligent all-wheel drive or four-wheel drive. There's also shift modes that'll give you sport or manual using the paddle shifters or simply standard. And the front double wishbone suspension is what is uh, incorporated with these new Fox live valve shocks. That'll give you 17.7 .7 inches of travel. In the rear, we've got a four-link trailing arm suspension setup also with the fox live valve shocks and that'll give you 20.1 inches of travel as i mentioned length and width on the unit 152 inches long 68 inches wide this is pretty much what it's been for a while but there is a slight width difference and that has everything to do with the increased travel in the suspension with that fox setup the wheelbase on this unit is 118 inches. We do have a little bit of bed capacity in the back, 299 pounds worth. The midpoint ground clearance, 13.2 inches. And it comes in at a curb weight of 1,843 pounds. And after all that, the question is, what does it cost? 2023 Talon 1000R4 with the Fox Live Valve shocks has a base MSRP of $25,799. Add on the destination free and freight surcharge, and you're looking at probably around 27 out the door. So we're back in off the trails, and as you can tell, we've had a lot of fun today. Certainly, if you can measure it by how much mud is on our machine, well, then we had a boot. And frankly, that's what this Talon is all about. I mean, it's just about fun. There's no practicality in this machine. It's all about the fun factor, and in this case, it's family fun. It's fun for four people. Frankly, you can get adults back there, so don't think that you got to only stuff your kids in here. So, you know, I hope you've enjoyed what you've seen I certainly enjoyed driving this course out here today so that's it for this one folks but you know what come back again soon because luckily uh, manufacturers keep giving us more fun machines like this to use so that's it go below please hit like hit subscribe and remember to join our channel and then come back soon because I'm gonna go out and do more of this soon